So we're two for two. You want the black with the lime green, black with the silver. What do you think, Norman? I love it. I love it. Good deal. Good deal. I love the outlets, man. You can't beat it. You know, they're here from Texas. I want to show them a good time. You know, manage the money, stretch it as far as we can. My wife's making oxtails, so it's going down when we get to the house. Hey everyone, so while the guys are out shopping um, because they needed to get some things, I am making caldo de res, which is basically just a beef soup, which is very good and it's a Mexican tradition and it's just delicious. So I decided to make it because Bubba's has been sick, so I think that the vegetables will really help them. As a matter of fact, I know they will because having soup when you don't feel good is the best thing. So I'm excited, it's gonna be good and it, the meat is cooking right now actually. We were on our way out the door, almost out the door. Norman found another pair. I can't believe the sale. And I gotta tell you family, you know what? You, well guys will understand more than anything but you know how it is when you always do things for your wife, you always do things for your kids, and then you forget about yourself. And that's what happens, man. You know, we, we work really hard, we want the best for our families, we love our families, our foundation is our rock. So, Norman's like me. You know, we do so much for ourselves, and it's like, you feel guilty. And I told him, just do it, man, you deserve it. That's what working hard is all about. You gotta reward yourself sometimes. So how's it feel, man? That's correct. I want to take another one. Three per. Kapow! Big time. In there, I put some onions, some garlic cloves, and some oxtails. And uh, they're cooking right now. They have another hour or so to go. So I'm actually calling Jenny to get Papa's size. I should know that, right? But I forgot. Is that bad of me? Don't be mad at me, family. Norman's laughing at me. Your call has been forwarded to an... Okay, we left Nike, we left Marshalls, but the lady told us when we were walking out of Nike they had clearance on the pants and the shorts and sweats and all that, so we're going back. You ready, Norman? Of course. Second round. All the veggies and all the other ingredients are in here. Um, cilantro, onion, uh, Mexican squash, and tomato, and all the good stuff. Okay, I'm at Smith's. We were shopping, and we got interrupted because Jenny needs corn on the cob, so uh, my breaking away, spending some guy time, you know, doing a little shopping, just got cut short, but it's okay. I got to do what I got to do, so... We're gonna grab this corn and then uh, I'm gonna grab some wine. Jenny wants some wine. So I just ran some errands with Norman and I said, you know what, let me go spend a little one-on-one -on -one time with my son. So I went and grabbed him. We're gonna go get this auxiliary cord from Radio Shack. Bye, mm -hmm. Say hi, family. Hi. Bye, bye. Say hi, family. Hi. <laughs> Beautiful day with my son. They always say the apple don't fall too far from the tree, right? I'll die for this boy. I love him. I love him. I love him. Uh. So what you doing, man? I'm just gonna go get some butter. Okay. I thought you were getting Kit Kat. I want to get Kit Kat. Please. Okay. I want to get butter and toast and Kit Kat. Okay. My son wants a Kit Kat, so I'm gonna get him a Kit Kat because he was really good in school today, and he's feeling better. We're getting rid of that cough. Thank the Lord. I gotta tell you, women, you're not gonna understand this, but men, you will. Husbands especially, boyfriends. Wife sends you to get some stuff. She's cooking, and then she calls you, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I'm going as fast as I can. It's not my fault she wanted all this stuff. I'm trying to get what she asked me to get. Help me, family, please. Baby smells good in the kitchen. Thank you. What are you I doing? because I'm just stuck in the kitchen cooking. I'm just kidding. I'm making cornbread. I grew up eating cornbread. Cornbread with butter, especially like in my collard greens or mustard greens. I loved to like put mustard it in there. Greens? Oh yeah, babe. I've I, never heard of that. I gotta teach my wife about that one. But anyway, it smells really good in here. We're gonna get the cooking channel going soon now that we got the kitchen situated. Um, thank you for being patient. My wife wants to bring more cooking videos. We're just really trying to get organized and you know, it gets a little chaotic and we just want things to look right when we're filming and you know what's up, family, so. You know what up. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just finished the caldo and it turned out really amazing. It's the first time I make it, so I was really happy to, you know, learn how to do it. My grandma um, gave me the recipe on the phone, so thank you, grandma. I love you, and I'm ready to eat. Look at this. Yummy. Were you guys flirting at the shoe store? No. 
Norman? Okay. Yes, yes, yes. He was flirting, I can tell in his face. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes, no, he said, like, look yeah. at the face. Yeah, yeah he's smiling yeah. today. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he was trying to speak Spanish. Rico Suave. Let me show you guys how my aunt is like the TLC moms from Toddlers and Tierras, okay? Watch this. <laughs> Norman! LOL, Snake of a Dog! Hey, you gotta sing Twinkle Twinkle. Oh, no. <laughs> Terrific. Here. I am see? with Nicki Minaj. Wait, give me the phone so I can your phone. No. Okay. Twinkle, twinkle, cheerleader, twinkle, twinkle. Dance. Look at dancing. Go, dance. like, I'm not a part of that. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Lee. See it? What? See it? Pooping. It's pooping.